As a child, I never really wanted to become a priest. When I am asked uh, before uh, what I would want to be when I grow up, I usually answer, uh, I want to become a doctor or a pilot, the usual answers of the kids then. Um, I never really entertained uh, wanting to become a priest. When I was in high school, I uh, joined this uh, uh, charismatic group and I attended the Life in the Spirit seminar. And that's when everything changed. I went to Mass every day and then I joined different organizations in our parish like uh, the Lectors and Commentators Guild and then also um, the choir. And then uh, as I uh, graduated in high school, somehow I, I told my, my mom that I, I'm considering the the thought of uh, entering the seminary. But she said since um, uh, De La Salle University was just near our place, and it's just walking distance, that I should consider finishing a degree first before entering the seminary. And so uh, the good boy that I am, no, I uh, uh, went to college, and the, um, college life was uh, so, um, like I was very happy in college, I forgot about the calling. No, all together, I forgot about it. And then I graduated October, October of 1992. And I said, before I uh, work, I would want to rest first. So, so November, December, and I would apply in January. But while I was um, resting, uh, I just found myself reading books about the saints. And I rented this video uh, entitled The Brother, Son, Sister Moon, The Life of St. Francis of Assisi. While watching the movie, I was really crying profusely. While wa and I said to myself, I really felt that God was calling me to the priesthood. And so when I told my mom, uh, since I already finished college, then they allowed me to, uh, to apply. And so I entered um, uh, San Jose Seminary in, uh, with the Jesuits. And right now, as a priest, I am um, really happy you know, uh, being able to respond to the call. And one time, I met my friends, my classmates in college, and uh, we had uh, some sort of a get-together in a very uh, classy place in Makati. And um, they were talking about their different businesses, the things that they owned already. And the human side of me, I was thinking, Maybe if I did not become a priest, I will also have these things. I will have my own place, maybe my own condominium in BGC or uh, somewhere in Makati. And I will have the different cars that they're talking about. Uh, if I uh, pursued the business side of, uh, of me. But going back to my parish in Novaliches, in Our Lady of Fatima, somehow it dawned on me, maybe... I will have those things and perhaps even more. But maybe at the end of the day, the question that I need to ask myself is, maybe I, I will have those, those things, but will I be as happy, as contented, and at peace right now that I know that uh, I am in my calling, I am where I should be as the priest of our Lord Jesus Christ. For information on the priesthood or religious life, Log on to www.ewtn.com slash religious life.